and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is super exciting. It is a huge collab with two of my really, 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 really good YouTube and in real life friends, Tara Mascot and Jill Cimarelli. So today's video is a mishmash of two videos that I really wanted to do. So one video that I've always wanted to do is like a seasonal, insert season here blank, inspiration video. So for this season, it'd be fall inspiration. And I've always wanted to do a road trip video and it just so happened that the three of us actually went on a road trip together during the fall. So I figured why not take the two and make a cute little baby out of it. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys snacks and drinks and like essentials and just like footage from my road trip slash also being inspired by fall. And I cannot wait for you guys to see it. So Jill and Tara also did very similar videos and I will link them down below. They are seriously amazing. They make awesome videos. Some of the nicest people that I know and I highly recommend you guys check them out. And also all our vlog channels will be listed down below because we all vlogged our road trip and our trip to Palm Springs. That's where we went by the way. And it was so much fun. We stayed in this giant house and it was just like the time of our lives. So I think that's about it. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and let's get started. All right guys, so we are going to kick off this video with some snacks and treats that are perfect for the fall time. And we're gonna start with some on the go caramel apples. All you're gonna need is some green Granny Smith apples, some caramel bits and some milk. It's super, super easy. All you're gonna do is just take your caramel bits, put them into a microwave safe bowl and add in a splash of milk. Then go ahead and put that in the microwave for about a minute or so and then let that completely melt down. After that is done, we can go ahead and move on to our apples. So I'm just cutting my apples right down the middle and then taking a metal spoon or just something to kind of core out the middle of the apples. These are just going to act as a holder for our caramel inside of them. These are seriously so good. If you like caramel apples, you're going to love them. All you're going to do is just pour in your caramel after, throw it into the fridge, and then slice them up and you have on the go caramel apples. Moving on, we're going to make some pumpkin spice puppy chow. All you need is cinnamon checks, white chocolate, pumpkin pie spice, and powdered sugar. It's super easy and super delicious. All you're going to do is start by taking your cinnamon checks and pouring them into a big bowl mixed with some melted white chocolate as well as some pumpkin pie spice. That is actually very hard to say. You're just going to throw that in there and then give it a nice big stir so that all the cinnamon checks are completely coated and they're nice and um, chocolatey I guess you could say. And after our checks are all coated, go ahead and add in some powdered sugar, just enough to coat them all. You can also add in sprinkles if you'd like. I added in some Halloween sprinkles just because I think they're cute and they add a little pop of color. And just go ahead and keep stirring until they're all coated. And then after that, just go ahead and turn them out onto a baking sheet lined with parchment paper so they can completely dry. After that, you can go ahead and add it to like a trail mix or something like that, or you can just eat them plain. I added them to a trail mix that I actually put in my fall baking video, which I will link down below. It is amazing and so perfect for the fall. If you wanna take it on a road trip or something, they are awesome. Next, I wanted to show you guys one of my favorite fall outfits or basically my go-to kind of combination. Since I live in Southern California, it never really gets that cold, so this is just something that I always reach for. So my little long sleeve is from Target and I absolutely love the olive green color. I'm wearing a Free People bralette underneath along with my favorite black jeans in the world which are from American Eagle and some Converse sneakers. Moving on, I wanted to share some of my fall road trip essentials with you guys and also just some normal fall essentials. So first of all, we have a sweatshirt or a sweater or a zip up, whatever you call them. It is so comfortable. This one is from American Apparel and it is the softest thing I have ever put on my body. I've been wearing this seriously every day lately. Like it's actually, it's kind of becoming a problem, but I absolutely love it. Next is a neck pillow. I got this at the airport and it is memory foam and perfect if you are going on a road trip and you need to take a nap or something like that. Moving on, hats, I absolutely adore door hats, especially this one. This is perfect for the fall because of the burgundy color and it was super inexpensive from Forever 21. I also love bringing my Instax mini or Polaroid camera with me everywhere because you can make memories and just record them and it's so adorable. Also, some headphones are definitely a necessity no matter where I'm at. Just plug it into your phone. You can jam out to your music. My vlog camera is a must. If you don't know, I have a vlog channel and I love taking my vlog camera with me and just recording all my memories. Also, some other little essentials that I have are some dark lipsticks, a good like highlighter or something like that, a fuzzy blanket, cozy socks, and a candle of some sort. Those are definitely some fall essentials for me. And last but not least, a hot drink is definitely a necessity. So I wanted to share with you guys a recipe for salted caramel hot chocolate. It is amazing. All you're gonna do is start by taking two cups of milk and adding it to a pot along with five tablespoons of unsweetened cocoa powder. This stuff is pretty bitter, but it's still really, really good. You're also gonna add in some sea salt. That's gonna give it that salty flavor as well
well as half a cup of sugar and a splash of vanilla extract. Then go ahead and top it off with just a third of a cup of caramel sauce, and this is gonna add that really good caramel flavor, obviously. Then just go ahead and move it to the stove at medium heat and whisk it until it all melts down together like this. And once it's all ready and nice and hot, go ahead and pour it into a mug, and you can top it with whatever you'd like. I added a little bit of whipped cream. My whipped cream is very sad looking. And then just a drizzle of caramel and a sprinkle of salt, and it is the best thing in the world. And my last fall inspiration tip is for if you're ever feeling bored or if you have some free time or or if you're just in the mood to explore. I took a mini road trip with my friends to Palm Springs and I had the time of my life. Road trips are so much fun and a great way to get out and see the world and just experience new things and I absolutely love it. I think it'd be so much fun to road trip with your friends to different states and just experience the leaves changing and like cold weather and things like that because I have never experienced that before and I think it sounds absolutely amazing. And even if you can't go out on a road trip, don't sweat it, just grab your friends, go out and explore, find some place new. You will not regret it, I promise you will have the time of your life and you will thank me later. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please be sure to give this a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye!